Welcome back guys, my name is Marcos and today we're here at the shop. Not much going on, not many customers. Beautiful day out outdoor. Canelo's here, he's just bored, I'm bored. So we did get a new phone. We got a new phone, it's called the Moto G Play. And we're gonna take a look at it. We're gonna see what it's all about. Let's see how good it looks. Um, so uh, don't forget to drop a like, uh, subscribe, ask a question in the comments below. Let me know if you got this phone and let me know what you think about it. Uh, let's get started. All right guys, so we did take out the phone out of the box. Um, here on the shell in the front of the phone, we do see the name of the phone, Moto G Play. 6.5 inches HD plus max vision display, which is pretty standard for Motorola. Up to three days of battery. It has dual camera systems, which means it has a 13 megapixel camera in the back. So 13 megapixel camera, it has two cameras, dual, and I'm, I'm guessing the main camera is a 13 megapixel. And then the front facing here in the front is a five megapixel camera. So 6.5 inches display, HD display. And it also tells us that it does have a, what's called a 1.8 gigahertz Qualcomm, Qualcomm Snapdragon processor, which usually is pretty good, an octa-core processor from, from Qualcomm, uh, not bad at all. Here in the back of the box, we do see that it says three days batteries. It probably has a 5,000 milliamp battery. I'll double check that right now. 32 gigs of uh, memory, three gigs of RAM, so it's not bad at all. Uh, let's see if we can get in the phone, see what else what else it's running. It's probably running Android 11, but let's check it out. So Moto G Play. So the Moto G Play right now retails for 129, brand new device with this mobile. 129 um, when you buy this phone full price. Uh, if you're an eligible upgrade or if you get a new account right now, you're looking at about $59 for the phone, so they give you a discount. And then the best deal they have on this device is when you add a line. So if you add a line right now, say you have a $50 plan, you add a line and you go into a store, you can actually get this phone for $15 plus the first month in activation, but it's still better than $129 just for the phone. So it's a great deal. Um, like I said, we have a 6.5 HD Max Vision display. Um, here on the left side, we do see that we have a SIM card slot opener right there. It's a nice cool blue. Here at the bottom, we do have a Type-C port. We do have the speakers. We do have the, um, the power button and the volume rocker here on the, on the, on the right side. Uh, in the back, we do have a fingerprint sensor for security. And then we also have the dual camera, which is a 13 megapixel camera with a flash. It has this nice cool blue in it, on it. On the top, we do have the headphone jack, so pretty standard device. And then um, under the hood, we, do, we are running, like I said, 32 gigs of memory. We do have a 5,000 milliamp battery, and um, and the battery should last about three days, according to what uh, Motorola says and stuff like that. And then let's see what kind of software we're running. Software, software, software. So we are running Android 10. Um, pretty standard, like I said, it's a pretty pre entry level device. I like it for $60 or even $15 when you add a line. It's such a great deal. Uh, in the box, there was not much going on in the box. You don't get any headphone jacks or anything like that. You just get this uh, Motorola brick and this USB Type-C charger, pretty standard, about three feet long, and a little SIM card slot opener, and this little legal stuff from Motorola. Uh, that's it, pretty much nothing else in the box. So, so like I said, we're here at the shop. So we're gonna try and see if we can check out the camera. Let's see how good the zoom is. Uh, here's the picture of the shop before, and then here's the phone in front of us. So it is a 13 megapixel camera and it has a very good zoom. So it does zoom very good. Uh, let's see if we can see that flyer with the promotions. So it does get a little. So we can almost read the stuff at the bottom. It's a little hard, but yeah, we can zoom very close. You can see the phones, buy one, get one. Buy one, get one poster right there. And then America's largest 5G network or 5G for less. So yeah, and it, it has multiple settings. Um, you could, uh, what is it? Do portrait mode, cutout, spot color, panorama pictures, slow motion and time-lapse. So it does, it's, it's a pretty nice camera. It's not, not too basic and 
let's see what else we can do we can also record um we can change the aspect ratio right then and there uh turn on the flash so if you need a if you want to take a bigger picture you would change the aspect ratio like that so not bad at all front facing camera uh it's not bad at all it is a five five megapixel camera let me get back to this where do we go front facing camera i am recording with my iphone so not bad at all so front facing camera front facing camera is not bad at all either uh you can zoom on it uh you can record if you wanted to you can turn on the flash you can also turn on the face beauty so i don't know if it's supposed to make me more beautiful but uh let's see let's see if it works uh, it's not like a filter but oh here look oh, so i guess it gives me like color or something like that. i don't i don't know but not bad at all entry level device so for 130 or 15 dollars when you add a line you can't beat this phone Motorola's coming out it's kind of taking over from uh uh the lg spot because lg used to make more phones but now they're going away so Motorola stepping it up bringing in some entry level devices i love the starting price of this phone it's only 129 dollars, like i said a couple times before so um yeah all right guys you know me if you've been watching my channel for a while all my videos i like to test out the sound because sound is very important so let me see if i can find something without copyright and let's check it out So as you can see, the sound's coming from the bottom, coming from this bottom speaker here on the right. And it's fairly loud, not bad. I give it about a good eight or nine. And then you can uh, make the screen bigger. It looks good, colors look good. It is an HD display, so not bad at all. So about an eight or nine sound wise so not bad at all screen is good size is perfect fits great in your hand so not bad at all here's the back this phone is running android 10 so so there you have it guys like i said this was a quick unboxing just telling you about the quick features on this device it's a nice entry level device for 130 full price $59 when you get an upgrade or a new number, $15 when you add a line. So it's a great phone if you're not trying to break the bank. Um, and it's a quality phone. I mean, you get three gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of memory, uh, 6.5 HD display. So you get everything for under $150. So it's a good phone to get started with if you're trying out booze or if you need to switch over or if you broke your phone, it's a great phone. Like I said, my name is Marcos. And if you have any questions, you can drop them down in the comments below. Um, not trying to make this video super long, but thanks for watching. Have a good one.